Like and subscribe right now, or you're gonna have terrible luck for the next week. Snakes are nightmare fuel, to some of us at least. They come in various sizes, but it's with the bigger ones that we're fascinated with. How big? Well, let's find out, shall we? He's large and aggressive, but not venomous. Boas are non-venomous constrictors found in tropical Central and South America. Jeez! Oh, and nothing! <laughs> Significantly smaller than anacondas, boas can grow up to 13 feet long and weigh more than 100 pounds, with the largest specimen ever caught measuring 14 feet in length. Their jaws are lined with small, hooked teeth for grabbing and holding prey while they wrap their muscular bodies around their victim, squeezing it until it suffocates. Did you catch that? Their bodies can be tan, green, red, or yellow, and display cryptic patterns of jagged lines, ovals, diamonds, and circles. It's the wide palette of colors that make many snake enthusiasts want to keep them as pets. This monster of a snake is native to Sub-Saharan Africa. It is one of the largest snake species in the world, and although it rarely attacks humans, it is greatly feared. With the largest specimen measured at 25 feet in length, it's not hard to imagine why. On average, though, they measure between 11 and 13 feet. I said they rarely attack humans. I never said they didn't. In fact, a large African rock python was responsible for probably the worst snake attack in Africa's history when it attacked and swallowed a 10-year-old boy who was walking home with friends after school. They are considered primitive snakes, possessing two functioning lungs, unlike more advanced snakes which have only one, and also have small, visible pelvic spurs believed to be the vestiges of hind limbs, which harkens back to the days of snakes still having legs. Native to the jungles and grassy marshes of Southeast Asia, Burmese pythons are among the largest snakes on Earth. They are capable of reaching 23 feet or more in length and weighing up to 200 pounds with a girth as big as a telephone pole. Although they are often quite shorter than the African rock python, they make up for it in weight and girth. This silent eating machine has moved straight to the top of the Everglades food chain. It also doesn't matter how large the prey is, they have stretchy ligaments in their jaws that allow them to swallow all their food whole. Large reticulated pythons normally eat mammals and birds, with items as large as deer and pigs being readily taken and, as always, swallowed whole. Generally regarded as the longest living snake in the world, reticulated pythons have been recorded reaching legs of up to 33 feet long. Of course, those measurements are unverified, but one reticulated python named Samantha was measured to be 26 feet back in 2012. These large snakes move slow, but strike fast. They are usually found near watercourses, amongst rainforests or woodlands. They will retreat into crevices and caves after feeding, with most of their activity taking place at night. They have a reputation for being an aggressive snake, and will not hesitate to defend themselves by raising their heads off the ground, hissing loudly, and if further harassed, striking repeatedly at the threat. Now he can't run away, he can't move very fast, so he's in the defenses mode. We're coming close, we'll have a few strikes at me. This beautiful snake is the longest snake in Australia, capable of growing to lengths of up to 24 feet, but on average are about 10 to 15 feet. It is a dull olive brown or greenish yellow in color, but the scales have an overall amethyst iridescence, which produces an attractive shimmering effect, especially in sunlight, making it one of the most beautiful snakes you'll ever see. The amethystine python is found in tropical rainforests and scrub forests in Indonesia, Papua New Guinea, Australia, and the Philippines. Small, younger pythons tend to spend most of their time up in the trees to avoid predation. Large ones spend most of their time on the ground in mangrove swamps, dense rainforests, or along stream and rivers in scrubland. They are also excellent swimmers. Like most of the large pythons, amethystines feed on a variety of small mammals such as fruit bats, rats, and possums. They will also eat small and medium-sized birds, and occasionally even large lizards such as monitors. King cobras live 
mainly in the rainforests and plains of India, southern China, and southeast Asia, and their coloring can vary greatly from region to region. In 1937, an 18.18-foot-long king cobra was captured in Nigeri Sembilan State on the Malai Peninsula. Taken and kept at London Zoo, it eventually grew to 18.73 feet before being killed at the outbreak of the Second World War to avoid putting the public in danger should the zoo be bombed and the snake escape. Their venom is not the most potent among venomous snakes, but the amount of neurotoxin they can deliver in a single bite, up to two-tenths of a fluid ounce, is enough to kill 20 people or even an elephant. King cobra venom affects the respiratory centers in the brain, causing respiratory arrest and cardiac failure. The yellow anaconda is a non-venomous boa species endemic to southern South America. It is one of the largest snakes in the world, but its size can't even come close to its green, much larger cousin. The color pattern consists of a yellow, golden, tan, or greenish yellow ground color overlaid with a series of black or dark brown saddles, blotches, spots, and streaks. Females in this species are generally larger than males. On average, they grow to about 13 feet long and weigh 77 pounds. Finding larger specimens are rare, but there is one that measured over 15 feet long and weighed 121 pounds, which is enough to land it on the fifth spot on this list. He is a stealthy hunter and his strike is lightning quick. The Indian rock python comes from the forests of Nepal, India, Sri Lanka, and Pakistan. You can usually see these guys near water in areas that offer plenty of cover. The largest Indian rock python recorded was measured at around 21 feet long, but they can be commonly found at more manageable lengths of between 12 to 14 feet, still enough to land it on number three on our list. They can also tip the scales at 200 pounds. The coastal taipan is often regarded as the most dangerous snake in Australia. Growing to an average 9 feet in length, with some even reaching 11 feet, these giant snakes aren't only big, but also deadly venomous. When the coastal taipan strikes, it injects a large amount of highly toxic venom deep into the flesh, and studies have shown that they are capable of injecting the same amount in a second or third bite. The venom affects the nervous system and the blood's ability to clot, and victims may experience headache, nausea, vomiting, collapse, convulsions, especially in children, paralysis, internal bleeding, myolysis, or the destruction of muscle tissue, and kidney damage. Antivenom for this snake wasn't developed until 1956, so any taipan bite prior to that was nearly always fatal. Almost no other predator on the planet inspires as much terror as the python. Now it's time for today's best pick. Okay, so these guys look like they're wrestling with a pretty large snake. While there's no doubt in my mind that a snake this size does exist, I'm pretty comfortable in saying that this photo is faked, with the snake made to look larger than it is. A member of the boa family, South America's green anaconda is, pound for pound, the largest snake in the world. Its cousin, the reticulated python, can reach slightly greater lengths, but the enormous girth of the anaconda makes it almost twice as heavy. Green anacondas can grow to more than 29 feet long, weighing more than 550 pounds, and measure more than 12 inches in diameter. They reach their monumental size on a diet of wild pigs, deer, birds, turtles, capybara, caimans, and even jaguars. Anacondas are non-venomous constrictors, coiling their muscular bodies around captured prey and squeezing until the animal asphyxiates. Jaws attached by stretchy ligaments allow them to swallow the prey whole, no matter the size, and they can go weeks or months without food after a big meal. 